For this example problem, I am going to solve the following one-step equation. x minus 2 equals 3. I am going to solve this problem by starting step 1. Step 1 says model the given equation. In order to model the equation on the scale, I am going to, on the left side, bring over x minus 2. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to drag over x. I am going to bring over two negative ones. That is the same as x minus 2, and here again it says x minus 2. Now, on my right side it has positive 3, so I am going to bring over 3 of the positive 1s. Okay, step 1 is complete. I'm going to go to step 2. Step 2 says balance the scale. So I, I'm, I'm going to repeat step 1 by bringing down my x minus 2 and my positive 3 on the right side. Now, my whole goal is to get x by itself. I want to know what is x. So in order to do, uh, to figure out what x is, I need to get rid of the negative 1s. I have two of them. I know that I can get rid of these by doing the opposite of negative 1 is positive 1, and those will cancel. So since I have two negative ones, I need two positive ones. And again, step two says balance the scale. So in order to balance the scale, whatever I do on the left side, I need to also do on the right side. So since I added two on the left side, I need to add two on the right side. Okay, I'm done with step two. I have balanced the scale. Step three, I am going to bring over exactly what I did on step two. So I'm bringing over my x minus 2, and then I'm also bringing over the positive 1s. I had two of those on my left side, so you can see the left side right here and the left side right here looks the same. And now I'm going to do my right side. So I have positive 3 that I started with, 1, 2, 3, and then I brought over two positive ones so that I could balance the equation. Okay, I'm almost done with step three, but what I need to do is bring over my x's. So you can see when I say x's, I'm not talking about my variable x, I'm actually canceling. So anytime I see opposites, so for example, this negative one and this positive one are going to cancel. This negative one and the positive one above it can cancel. Nothing over here cancels. They're all positive ones. Here I'm left with x. That's exactly what I wanted. So I get x equals positive 5. And I'm going to come down here and type in 5. And I am done. That's how you solve the problems and show your work.